Welcome to the Simi Valley Library tutorial, How to Place an Item on Hold. The Place Request feature in the online catalog allows users to place a hold on available items located at Simi Valley Library or any associated library branch. This feature allows patrons to search the catalog from any location or device and have the convenience of holding items at the physical library location for future checkout. In order to use this feature, you first must be a member of the library and have a library card number. If you already have a card, click on the account link on the menu bar, select the login slash register link on the drop down menu, and create a username and PIN. If you do not have a card, you can click on the registration link where you can register, and a card will be ready to pick up from the library as long as you show ID and proof of address. After conducting a search, you can click on the full display tab and check for availability. If there is an item available at the library of your choice, go to the Place Request tab, which will be on your right hand side. After you've clicked on an item, or you can go Return to List, you can click on the Place Request tab here as well. Once you're there, log in to your account. Select a pickup library and select an activation date, which will be the day you want to place the item on hold. After you've chosen a day, click on the Submit Request link. Now it says here, there are one active request for this title. Do you still want to place the request? It means someone has already placed a hold, so you're second in line. Just go ahead and click Continue if you'd like. After placing an item on hold, you can view your list of holds to check your status. Or you can even remove a request as I've done here. You can check your hold position, so you're number two in line, and give you an idea of maybe how long it might take you to be next to pick up your item. Or you can suspend your hold if you change your mind about holding the item, but want to keep it on your list for the future which is fine since the system lets you reactivate your item to request a hold again. So for example, I'll go ahead and suspend. And so it'll just be here on the list until I reactivate. And then if I like to reactivate, I can click on today's date or any future dates. Submit. Go back to request. And it's on the list again and so your status will be pending until someone at the library has re received your request and then you'll be able to come back and check on what date it will be available for checkout. Afterward, you can log out of the system. That's it. That's how you place a hold. Thank you for watching the Simi Valley Public Library tutorial.